Good afternoon, Kate. One of the world's most famous car is in Buffalo today. This car was a part of a race that happened in 1908, New York to Paris. Great race, and it's called the Thomas Flyer Automobile. The car has been restored to its condition as it appears at the end of the race. It usually stays in Reno, Nevada, but has been borrowed to be in Buffalo for this special Thomas Flyer exhibit. Jeff Mall is a great grandson of George Schuster, who is a mechanic and pilot of the car in the race. He is proud to share his family's automobile with the Buffalo community and beyond. President Roosevelt, when he heard that Italians, Germans and Frenchmen were going to race horses, carriages across the United States, wanted a, an American competitor in the field. He knew E.R. Thomas from his visits to Buffalo. So he actually called E.R. and suggested that America enter the Thomas Flyer to represent the United States. Well, in those days, when a president like Teddy Roosevelt suggested something, you did it. Jeff went on to say he will be signing his new book called The Man in the Car That Circled the Globe. The book features rare photos of the race, the car, George, and some Buffalo history. The Thomas Flyer automobile will be on display at the Buffalo Transportation Museum. You can see it now until the end of August 9th. In Buffalo, Alexandria Rios Malvia, Channel 2 News.